The Eight Gates formation mm -hmm. of Cao Ren lies mm -hmm. ahead. Walking straight into it would mean certain death. Who are you? Oh. My name is Xu Xu. I'm just passing by. What? Sounds suspicious to me. <laughs> suspicious? I can't disagree. However, I can provide you with that which you lack, Lord Liu Bei. You approach, knowing the identity of our brother. Hmm. Let's hear him out. What is it that I lack, then? Strategy. Someone to formulate plans. Control the flow of battle. A strategist. Hmm. So, you're here to offer your services. Ah, <laughs> well, not necessarily. I have heard, actually, talk of a wise man in these parts, known as the Sleeping Dragon. Is that you? Actually, no. Please, speak plainly. Just as you say, I do indeed require a strategist. Then, you wish to meet this man? Yes, very much. Then, you must do as I say. We will break through this formation. Then I will lead you to the Sleeping Dragon. Benevolence? Yes, benevolence is the true form of your intent. The light that spreads your brilliance across the land. Are you sure this is what you want? Yes. It is not me whom he needs at this time. Show him the path of benevolence, my lord. And lead him through the dangers of war. You are the only one who can do that. I wish I could be like you, you know? But it is simply beyond me. Where will you go? Where, you ask? to find a place for myself. He is in your hands now. <clears throat> you captured him, knowing this would happen, didn't you? Perhaps. Let's just see what transpires, shall we? I want to see how Lord Cao Cao evaluates him as a strategist. Shu Shu, isn't it? The strategy you deployed against the Eight Gates formation was quite something. Something of what exactly? failed to take a single stronghold of yours. Although, I did allow Lord Liu Bei to escape. Maybe that's enough. They'll take things from here. They'll do a better job of it than me too. My role in things is complete. What remains of my life is yours. That's all the spirit you have? You might be intelligent, but I have no use for a man with so little ambition. <gasps> 
my lord. Ah, Shu Shu. That day, when we first fought together, and now, seeing the battlefield from Wei's encampment, I realized that I have been lying to myself. The place I should be is here. I am no master of strategy, I fear. I am quite naive, in fact. Yet, make use of me, my lord. I, too, wish to light your way to glory. Well said. I have been waiting for you. From today, you walk with me. Now, your honor and courage will be needed more than ever. Oh, good. <clears throat> I made it in time. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Shu Shu, what brings you to Bon Castle? A plan, my lord. I have a way out of this peril. Zhuge Liang, Hong Tong, our strategy has worked. The triangle has lost its balance. And the battle with Wei and Wu will intensify. But, for now, let us just celebrate this victory. I can only hope that our Lord can hear our victory cry. So kind of you to offer. Mind if we leave it attached to your body, though? What? What do you mean? Come to Shu is what he means. We have all gathered here, drawn by our Lord's vision. You come true! My life, as an officer of Wei, has hereby come to an end. My new life belongs to you. I hear that Zhugo Lian has become Prime Minister of Shu. Hmm. We have the Wei Emperor. A Shu Emperor and Prime Minister. There are too many titles out there. How I... envy you, Liang. I can only wish that I had been allowed to be a strategist for Shu and aided in this endeavor. In honor of the occasion, there is something that I would like to say to everyone. In doing your work, I ask that you listen to others' opinions and learn to consider them fully, even if they differ from your own personal opinions. You each have pride in your own abilities. This can make listening difficult, I understand. To the best of my knowledge, the only one who could unfailingly do that was Shu Shu, my old friend, an example to us all.
could somehow return to that time, I would. No. I guess I would have made the same decision. That remains to be my weakness. I can never become Jugo Yang. Master Shushu, the Emperor has summoned you. I understand. I shall be there in a moment. But please, remind His Highness. I cannot offer any plans. As usual, I will only listen and give my opinion. Oh, 